Hello, it's Martha Babin Dreyer from Emmanuel Episcopal Church, and today is Wednesday, February 3rd. For our midweek meditation this week, I'll be reading from Common Prayer for Children and Families by Jennifer Gambert and Timothy J. Siemens, and I'll also be using God's Word, My Voice, as a children's lectionary by Lynn Zill Briggs. O oh God, make speed to save us. O oh Lord, be swift to help us. Glory to the Holy One, God beyond us, God with us, and God within us. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. A reading from Psalm 30. I will praise you, O oh Lord, because you have lifted me up. Sing to God, you servants of the Holy One. Give thanks for remembering God's holiness. Weeping may last through the night, but joy comes in the morning. You have taken away my sadness and turned it into dancing. And you have clothed me with joy. Therefore, my heart sings to you. O oh God, my God, I will give you thanks for everything. It's adapted from the St. Helena Psalter. For the fifth Sunday after Epiphany, a reading from the book of Isaiah, chapter 40, verses 21 to 31, adapted. Haven't you heard? Don't you understand? Isn't this what you've heard all your life? God sees the whole earth like a ball of dirt. And those of us who live here are like insects on it. God stretches out the heavens like a curtain across the sky and opens them up like a tent to camp in. God is mightier than any prince or king on earth. They are like seas which haven't taken yet root. When God blows on them, they shrivel up and the wind carries them off like dust. Is there anyone like me, says the Holy One? Before you answer that question, look at the stars and the mountains and ask yourself, so who made these? I made all the mountains and all the stars and call each of them by name. Why do you think you can hide from me, Jacob, or that I don't care about what you do, Israel? Don't you get it? God, the creator of every single thing, also created you. God never gets tired and knows everything and everybody. God is the only one who can give you the courage and the strength to do what you need to do. Young men will run out of energy before God does. But if you turn to God, he will give you what you need. You will be like a mighty eagle with wings that will make, take you anywhere. You will be like a runner that never gets tired. And your journey will never get old. The word of the Lord. I believe in God above. I believe in Jesus' love. I believe God's spirit too comes to tell me what to do. I believe that I can be kind and good, dear Lord, like thee. Say the Lord's Prayer, you may join me. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Thank you, God, for the joys of this day. We give you thanks. Let us bless our God. To God be thanks forever. May you have the energy 
and the peace you need with God's help. Enjoy the rest of your week, and I'll see you soon. So long.